Welcome friends. We are back today discussing with some of the interesting topics related to the COVID. Please don't forget to subscribe to our channel by tapping the subscribe button. Friends, in this era of COVID-19 pandemic, it is worth to know as much detail as possible about the disease from the authentic sources. Among the all bad global news, there are some positive news and positive observations from the India. Though cases are rising rapidly in our country, but so far only 3.2% fatalities are reported by the ICMR, that is Indian Council of Medical Research, which is really very good news and the least in the world. So, knowing this fact, we should not be very relaxed. We should not take the disease lightly. We should stick to all the preventive measures to restrict the disease in the community so that no more cases happens in this country. But one thing we must be aware of that for prevention at the community level, early detection and containment of the positive cases are must. Hence, it is important to know how to suspect COVID-19 in, in, in somebody who is suffering from COVID-19. Because we know that in India, it is not possible to test everyone because it is a 1.3 billion population country. It is absolutely not possible to test everyone. So we need to test the suspected ones or anybody who is in contact of the suspect. Henceforth, it is wise to know what are the symptoms of the COVID. Now, the majority of the symptoms which are popularized by the WHO and all the social medias, we all know about that. There's a fever, cough, shortness of breath, low oxygen saturation in the blood. These are the main symptoms by which we suspect someone is suffering from COVID or not. But in this video, I will discuss some of the symptoms which are not known to everyone, but these are very common. These are very common, but this is not known to everyone. Henceforth, it is wise to know by everybody. So most important thing, which is not very popular, people do not know about this among the symptoms of the COVID is anosmia. That is difficulty in getting the smell properly. Next important part is a loss of taste. That means you are losing taste. You are not liking your food. That could be one symptom of COVID. You may not have fever. Third symptom, which is not known by everyone is a confusion, especially in the elderly. Dizziness, they are feeling slightly dizzy, not very well. That could be one symptom of the COVID. There are a lot of digestive symptoms which has been reported related to the, uh, our GI system like nausea, indigestions, loose motions. You know, of late we have known a lot of children present with the loose motion in the, in the, with COVID. Pain of the man has also been reported as a symptom of COVID. Now there are some other symptoms like fatigue, weakness, malice. You have to be careful if you suddenly get these symptoms one fine morning. So please be careful. We all know about fever. But COVID can happen without fever, but there are a very sense of chill within. That is, we're feeling very cold from within. That could be one symptom of the COVID. Silent hypoxia has been reported in a lot of time. That patient does not complain of shortness of breath. But if you check his saturation by a saturation monitor, you'll find the saturation is below normal. That is another reported uh, common symptom, which is not known by everyone. Next come to the some dermatological complications lot of COVID patients presents with skin problems, especially some rashes, mainly lower extremity. Though it has been reported in the cold country, western countries, but in India also there are some cases where we have seen the skin rashes in the lower extremity. That could be one symptom. There are some rare but serious symptoms which are worth in mentioning in this era that is involvement of the kidney. Because you know COVID can lead to proteinuria, it can lead to Microhematuria that you cannot see the RBCs in the urine, but if you check the urine in routine microscopy, you can find RBCs in the urine. And sometimes there can be acute renal failure leading to the complete cessation of the urine, urine production. That could be one symptom of the COVID. And one of the most serious symptoms for which entire world is scared of is a hypercoagulable state which gets generated by the COVID, which may lead to the strokes in the brain, strokes in the heart. So we have to be very careful. There may be sudden stroke, which could be a symptom of COVID. I hope the information I have shared will be useful for everyone for early detection, for early suspicion of the COVID. And if you get any of the symptoms, apart from those known well-popularized symptoms like fever, shortness of the club, please contact your doctor so to test whether you have this problem or not. 
please don't forget to tap the subscribe subscription button of uh, our channel to get the relevant updates soon thank you for watching